We're getting into early December here. The weather's starting to get cold, but the deals for new construction homes are really heating up right now. And in this video, I'm gonna look at the nine cheapest new construction homes that you can buy in South Jersey right now. We're gonna take a look at the top nine. And the builders right now are offering a lot of incentives, reduced interest rates, buying down those, those rates or lowering the monthly payments, also offering some discounts and incentives on closing costs. And there are also some quick move-in available homes as well. So great time to think about buying a new home. Join me, we're gonna talk about the communities, the homes, the models, nine cheapest new homes in South Jersey. We help people achieve the highest quality of life through buying and selling real estate. If you're looking to buy a home or sell a home in New Jersey, Delaware, or Pennsylvania, my team and I would be honored to help. You can contact us at info at promptagents.com. And if you'd like me to consult with you if you're considering buying a new home, remember to contact me first before you call a builder or go to visit a model home. Coming in at number nine is Whitehall Gardens by Paparone Homes. This is a 55 and over community in Williamstown. Prices are starting at $356,900 in this community. The Whitehall Gardens is a active adult 55 plus community in Williamstown. Price ranges are starting at $356,900 up to $392,900. And I just recently had a client purchase a home in here they're very happy with Paparone Homes and the home that they purchased. So it is a really great community and they are enjoying their new home there. Now there are some different models that you have to choose from. The Primrose is two bedrooms, two bathrooms, 1,484 square feet, starting at the 356.9, all the way up to the Marigold, which is three bedrooms, two baths, 2,028 square feet, and that's starting at 392.9. There are also some models with an optional second floor loft. There will be a clubhouse built, but no pool. And there is a five year tax abatement at this community. Coming in at number eight is Aviana at Park West by Paparone Homes in West Deptford. And these homes are priced at 344,990. So next on our list is Aviana at Park West Townhomes. This is in West Deptford. And this is also by Paparone Homes. So let's take a look at the different models that are available. You have the Stowe model, that's 3099, three bedrooms, two baths, 1,531 square feet, all the way up to the Lux model, which is three bedrooms, two baths, 2,051 square feet at 389,900. So as we take a look at the Stowe, so here's a look at the Stowe floor plan. You have one car garage here, a foyer, optional recreation room powder room there on the first floor these are three stories you have on the second level living room dining room you have your island here kitchen and then uh, optional powder room here on the second floor and up top you've got three bedrooms uh, including an owner's suite owner's bath and the washer and dryer so that's a look at the stove one other thing to mention is the West Deptford has a lot of amenities. There's the Riverwinds Community Center, which is open year round, golf, swimming, fitness classes, rock climbing, indoor walking and running tracks. So a lot to offer in terms of recreation right nearby the community. Coming in at number seven are High Street Estates, townhomes in Glassboro by DR Horton, starting at $341,900. So next on our list is High Street Estates in Glassboro, New Jersey. Great location. And these are townhomes by DR Horton, starting at 341,990. And these are 1,500 square feet. And all of the uh, townhomes in this community are gonna be the same size. Let's go ahead and take a look at the floor plan here for the Monroe model. And this is three bedrooms, two and a half baths, on 1,500 square feet with the one car garage. So as we look at the, uh, the plan here, we'll zoom this in so you can see a little bit better. We've got the one car garage, foyer, powder room, kitchen, dining area, and living room. Upstairs, three bedrooms, owner's suite, and uh, also a uh, mechanical room, laundry over here. So uh, if you're looking for something new construction, townhouse, Glassboro area, DR Horton. It does build a nice uh, townhome product. I haven't been to this particular community, but I have been to several of the other townhome communities and they do a nice 
job with their with their designs. Number six, Legacy Acres in Berlin by Ryan Holmes is a 55 and over community. Price is starting at $333,990. Next on our list is Legacy Acres. This is a 55 and over community built by Ryan Holmes in Berlin, just off of Route 73. So a great location, convenient to getting to different places in the area. Um, lots of retail restaurants and offices uh, right on that 73. Uh, route, including hospital as well. So great location there. And let's take a look at the different models and prices available at Legacy Acres. So the lowest price one is the Aruba Bay. That's starting at $333,990. And that's two bedrooms, two bathrooms, 1,153 square feet with a two-car garage. And this does increase. You can go all the way up to the Eden K, which is a larger 1,696 square feet. Two car garage, three bedrooms, two bathrooms. Um, that has a first floor owner suite. So let's go take a look at the Aruba Bay a little bit more and just take a look at that, uh, at that model. We're gonna take a look at the floor plan here. So here's a floor plan. You have a two car garage, a flex room, bedroom, kitchen, great room, owner's bedroom with large walk-in closet, bath, and that's a look at the Aruba Bay. All right, so taking a look at the Legacy Acres site plan, you can see it as a smaller community here. Some of the models are actually on a basement and some on a slab, and there is no clubhouse, but there are pickleball courts and a pavilion and grills that are planned for the community. Also a tax abatement on this one. Number five is Tavistock in Mays Landing, and that's actually where I'm filming this video right now. New homes starting at $320,000, and these are available for quick delivery in January, February of 2023. So the Tavistock community in Mays Landing is an existing community and there are nine lots that were never built by the original developer. There is a new builder that has purchased these lots and they are building nine homes on this Tavistock property. So some of them are single family uh, detached homes that are approximately 1,405 square feet, two bedrooms, two baths with a two car garage. And then there are also going to be a couple duplex or twin homes that are gonna be also featuring a two car garage, a little smaller, 1,200 to 1,300 square feet. And they will feature a unfinished basement, a walkout basement in the back. So that's what's offered at Tavistock. Pricing is starting at $320,000. Now these homes at Tavistock are spec homes, so the builder has pre-selected everything for these homes. Most likely you're not going to be able to make any selections or option choices. And these are going to be completed most likely January, February of 2023. So pretty soon these deliveries will be available here. Coming in at number four, the carriage homes at Sickler Court by DR Horton. These are new townhomes starting at $304,990. So next on our list is the carriage homes at Sickler Court in Sicklerville, New Jersey. This is DR Horton again. And these are 1,500 square foot townhomes priced at $304,990. And this is going to be the same layout uh, as the Monroe as the other townhouse community from uh, DR Horton. So, Great value here if you're looking for something in the Sicklerville area, the carriage homes at Sickler Court. Coming in at number three are two townhome communities in Sicklerville, both built by Ryan Homes. The communities are called Independent Square and Corner Club, starting at $299,990. At number three on our cheapest places to live in South Jersey, we actually have Ty. These are both two townhome communities by Ryan Homes. Independence Square and Corner Club in both in the Sicklerville area. So let's take a look at these uh, townhomes here. So the Corner Club, see the information right there. Beethoven model is starting from 299,990. Three bedrooms, two bathrooms, 1,432 square feet with a one car garage. And it goes all the way up to the Strauss, which is 1,829 square feet with the one car garage. So let's take a look at the Beethoven and take a look at that floor plan for the Beethoven model. And we'll start here. So you have, this is again a three story. Uh, we'll start here at the lower level. You have the one car garage, a foyer, 
Uh, you've got your water heater there, optional recreation room, up to the main level with a living room, the kitchen here, optional uh, double door out to the patio. And then on the third floor, you have the owner's bedroom, owner's bathroom, closet, uh, second bathroom, and then two bedrooms, nine feet, two inches by 10 inches. So 10 feet, excuse me. So not huge, but that's the, the size of the uh, th three bedrooms there. Now, if we go back to Sicklerville and take a look at Independence Square, Independence Square, uh, again, similar with the townhomes, and it is the same model, the Beethoven, and the same pricing, $299, $990 for the Beethoven, and uh, going all the way up to the Strauss model. And coming in first place, we actually have a two-way tie for first place, cheapest homes, new construction in South Jersey. Both of these are built by Ryan Homes. Lifestyle at Cumberland is a 55 and over community, starting at $289, $990. So now we actually have a tie, a two-way tie for the number one spot, cheapest places to live, new construction in South Jersey. And uh, first we'll talk about Lifestyle Cumberland. This is a 55 and over community, single family homes. And this is right in Farmingdale in Cumberland County. So down towards the central south end of uh, South Jersey. Lowest price, 55 plus ranch homes in New Jersey with a five year tax abatement. So definitely a lot to offer at this community. And let's take a look at the models and what you get here. So the Aruba Bay starting from $289,990, under $300,000, two bedrooms, two bathrooms, 1,153 square feet with a two car garage. And you can go all the way up to the uh, Dominica Spring, which is 1,694 square feet. I believe we already showed you the Aruba Bay, so let's go take a look at the Dominica Spring floor plan just to get an idea. If you wanted something a little bit larger, what would that look like here in the community? And starting off here with the two-car garage, we have the foyer, and this is actually three bedrooms. So you have uh, two bedrooms here in the front, uh, dining room or flex room if you want to call it that, uh, bathroom here, laundry room, great room with dining area, kitchen with, with an island and then the owner's uh, bedroom and bathroom here with a large closet. So pretty nice layout here. And so that Dominica Spring model starts at $349,990. You want something a little bit bigger. And again, the cheapest new construction 55 plus right now, $289,990 for the Aruba Bay model. And coming in for the two-way tie is Hamilton Green in Williamstown, also by Ryan Homes, $289,990 for the price of those homes. So last but not least, Hamilton Green coming in as the cheapest uh, new construction in South Jersey. These are townhomes in the Williamstown area. And these are also built by Ryan Homes, three-story townhomes. And uh, let's take a look at what you get at Hamilton Green. So there is just one model there. It's the Juniper. It's three bedrooms, two bathrooms, 1,564 square feet. Getting starting at 289,990. So let's take a look at the floor plan here. And uh, on the lower level, you have the one car garage, you have a finished basement area, and then steps going up. The main level has a great room, kitchen with an optional island, dining room. And then upstairs, three bedrooms. You have the owner's bedroom with a bath, a closet another full bath in the hall and then two bedrooms kind of smaller size nine feet two by ten nine by ten approximately so those are the cheapest new construction homes available right now in south jersey so these are the top nine cheapest new homes in south jersey and you know they're not for everyone if you're looking for something a little bit nicer or maybe you're interested in a resale home we can help with that reach out at info at promptagents.com Number nine on my list was the Whitehall Gardens 55 and over community. This is a great community. If you'd like more information on that one, check this video I did of that community and toured one of the models over there.